Hi guys, my name is Liana. At the time of this video recording, I was at one of the hotels in Mary. As we all know, every student who comes from the peninsula must be quarantined for 14 days before being allowed to return to their home. So this is me in my quarantine room, sharing my personal story about God's goodness throughout this MCO. Before the MCO came into force, I was going to study like crazy for my final exam. But when the MCO was enforced, honestly, I was demotivated at first because I didn't know what to do next. There was no usual final exam and my plan is basically ruined. Throughout this season, the health of my family, friends, pastors and mine has always been my concern. Besides that, I'm concerned about my studies and internship too. A few of my friends were rejected for internship placement, although they were accepted before the MCO. What about mine? What about my other friends? There's uncertainty. Even after we made some plannings, many were not fulfilled. At the beginning of the MCO, everything is uncertain. Honestly, at first, I was losing hope because I was too worried and think that this is the end. Doubts start creeping in. But God is good. He reminds me that I should not fear. Instead, to be strong in times like this. Our pastors has helped me a lot in keeping up with my spiritual life. All the motivation, advices, and powerful sharings. I am reminded again and again with God's promises and His presence with us at all times. Besides, my life group friends are supportive in prayers and spending time online and offline. If not, I know I'll be stressed out and anxious. I'm grateful for everyone that has been with me through this time. And I know that this is some of the ways Jesus is with me physically. Now, back to my quarantine experience. Being quarantined in UTP and in the hotel is different. In UTP, you can still go out and see the sun every day, and you can still meet other people. But in the hotel, I don't get any sunlight, and I cannot meet other people, and we are not allowed to go out from our room, except for emergency things only. From this, apart from being grateful with what I have, I have learned that we cannot live by ourselves. We need others to talk, to share, and to do things together. I am happy to say that I was released from my quarantine room in less than 14 days. So currently, I am back with my family and continue with my self-quarantine at home. I am happy to be back and glad to know that my family is healthy. So church, God's love does not change despite our changing circumstances. God's faithfulness to us is always there even when we doubt Him. Keep your eyes on Jesus. Stay connected to your life group and other believers. Till next time, bye!